Lamar Jackson just might have hinted at his future with the Baltimore Ravens when he posted on his Instagram story Monday morning. In a reposted message on his story, meaning Lamar Jackson did not write the quote himself, it sounds as if he is trying to tell the Ravens something regarding his aspiring contract with the team. When you have something good, you don't play with it. The quote read, you don't take chances losing it. You don't neglect it. When you have something good, you pour into it. You appreciate it. Because when you take care of something good, that good thing takes care of you too. That's what Lamar Jackson posted on his Instagram story this morning. The reason a lot of people are speculating that Lamar Jackson could leave the Baltimore Ravens in the offseason was because a lot of people expected him to play in the game against the Bengals, but people didn't know the extent of his injury, including the Ravens. Here's why. After missing another practice last Thursday ahead of the Ravens wildcard matchup against the Bengals, Lamar Jackson shared an update on his injured knee. Thank you everyone for your support and concerns regarding my injuries. Jackson's tweet read, I want to give you all an update as I'm in the recovery process. I have suffered a PCL grade 2 sprain on the baller line of a strain 3. There is still inflammation surrounding my knee and my knee remains unstable. I'm still in good spirits as I continue with treatments on the road to recovery. I wish I could be out there with my guys more than anything, but I can't give 100% of myself to my guys and my fans. I'm still hopeful we still have a chance. The Ravens' decision not to play injured star quarterback Lamar Jackson in the wildcard game against the Bengals sparked a whole lot of conversation over the weekend. But one prominent NFL analyst says it was absolutely the correct move. Former NFL quarterback Mike Vick was among Lamar Jackson's loudest critics. As the Fox analyst said, Jackson should have tried to play through his knee injury. You are three games away from the Super Bowl. Put a brace on it, Mike Vick said. Get it going. Put a brace on it. Let's go. I played the whole season on a sprayed MCL. Now, this was actually shocking because out of all people, I thought Mike Vick knew better. But the person that made the most sense was another former quarterback who fiercely defended the decision not to play Lamar Jackson. Robert Griffin III, RG3, who competed in the playoff game with a knee injury in January th 2013, believes Lamar Jackson and the Ravens made the right call. RG3 wrote on Twitter, This is why you don't just put a brace on it. Played with no ACL and LCL for my brother slash team. Changed the trajectory of my career. Inside is 2020. I didn't have the luxury that Lamar Jackson has. He's doing the right thing. Before further injuring his knee in that playoff game, Griffin was 9-6 with Washington while making the Pro Bowl and winning the Offensive Rookie of the Year award. After the injury, he just went 5-15 with Washington over the next three years. The team released him in 2016 and he went on to make unmemorable career stops with the Browns and Ravens. Lamar Jackson will become an unrestricted free agent this offseason, but the Baltimore Ravens reportedly want to work out a long-term contract with a quarterback. The 2019 NFL MVP hasn't played since Week 13 as he deals with a knee injury. After the Baltimore Ravens were eliminated from the playoffs in Sunday's 9-24-17 wildcard loss to the Cincinnati Bengals, the Baltimore Ravens will now focus its attention on offseason priorities.